Hey everybody, welcome back to my 365 challenge. This is day 326. I hope everyone's doing as well as can possibly be hoped for under these or any circumstances. Uh, let's see, so the tour concluded yesterday. What an amazing tour, such a nice respite. So much positivity and cooperation and you know, sally forth in the middle of a huge pandemic. And like the day before the last day of the tour, they had 14,000 new cases in France. And and they're still carrying on the tour, social distancing as much as they can. But, you know, 100 and, what is it, 16-year tradition, 117-year tradition. Um, I don't know. It's just It was just really nice to see a, a really well-contested tour also. So everybody is, and when I say tour, of course I mean the Tour de France, the greatest sporting event in the world. Um, youngest rider since 1904 to win the, the tour, the yellow jersey. Tade Pogacha, Pogi. And he also won the King of the Mountains, and he also won Best uh, New Rider. No one's ever done that before. And um, he put the hurt on the previous leader in the time trial, the day before the last day, the penultimate stage, the last time he could have possibly made up time. It was heroic. It was epic. It was so inspirational. And uh, <clears throat> with very few exceptions, there's, just, there's no trash talk in the tour. They're, they're gentlemen. You know what I mean? They're just, it's, it's such a treat. It's such a s civilized event. Yeah, there's a lot of money, and I know there's like, homophobia, and I know there's blah, blah, blah. And I don't give a fuck. It's an amazing event. Amazing event. And it's, uh, it's, it's like, it's a great example of, um, like the power of individual achievement, but individual achievement that's only possible without huge team support, without huge cooperative effort. It's, I don't know, it's just a beautiful thing. And then the, the French countryside, it was all in France this year. They didn't travel outside. Crowds were way down because, for one, it's, it's a month later and um, tourist season is pretty much done. Um, it was cooler. They lucked out on the weather, especially in the mountain stages. And um, and what else? I don't know. That's just... It was cool. It was a nice thing to just sit with for a few hours a day and soak up some history and pageantry and color and just awesome athletic prowess. So, anyway... Uh, today, uh, one of my friends, John Z, posts regular pictures from out of out his back door on the lake up in uh, northern Colorado. <clears throat> and uh, one titled recently was "Frog Ripples," or or "Sunset with Frog Ripples," something like that. And I thought, "Frog Ripples, what a great name for a tune!" So, this tune, day three hundred and twenty-six, I'll call. Frog ripples. I just came up with it, so forgive me if it's not all polished. Frog ripples.
playing around with some frog ripples. I need to get my chops back in shape. Three, four, five. Anyway, <clears throat> uh, I was... So one thing uh, the commentators, Phil Liggett, who's been doing the tour for 48 years, talks about how some of the riders talk about other riders. And, oh, they're, they're good friends off the, off the course, and then they fight like crazy on the course because they're fierce competitors. And talking about how people say, oh, he's just the nicest person. He never has a bad word to say about anybody. He takes everything all calmly and easy. And I thought, oh, it'd be great to be like that. And... You know, I realize I'm just not like that. I have opinions, and when people are being, I don't know. A person can be mean. A, a person can be stupid. But if a person is mean and stupid, I react. You know, if a person's just being dumb, there's a teachable moment. If they're being dumb, dumb and mean and spiteful and supporting, you know, fascists, <laughs> then... Uh, I don't know, they need to be spoken out against. And, you know, I don't have anything to lose, so I can speak out. I don't know if I really have anything to gain either, but <clears throat> I can't just sit silently and watch people be mean and stupid and bullies and that kind of stuff. I just can't, can't abide by it. I don't agree to disagree that it's their right to be a stupid, mean bully. No, they don't have a right to do that. They don't not in not in my sphere for what that is worth. Anyway, take care, y'all. Until next time. Oh yeah. Like if you don't mind. October thirty first is will be the wrap up of this three sixty five challenge. Join me for something or maybe I'll tape something and just post something nice. Um I don't know if I'll be able to have people over or not. Um, we'll see. We've got I got time to plan that. And um, do subscribe. Yeah. Peace out.